Welcome back, movie lovers. Today, we're diving into the action-packed world of Hercules. Get ready for a thrilling journey as we recap the epic story of the mighty demigod and his fearless band of mercenaries. Let's jump right in. Born as the son of Zeus and immortal queen, Alcim, Hercules was destined for greatness. But not everyone was happy about his existence. Zeus's wife Hera saw him as an insult, despite him being named after her. From a young age, Hercules battled countless assassins sent by Hera. As he grew into manhood, Hercules faced the ultimate challenge, completing the legendary Twelve Labors. He fought the Linian Hydra, battled the Aramanthian boar, and defeated the Nenean lion, proving his unmatched strength and heroism. Fast forward to a rugged Hercules, Dwayne Johnson, now the leader of a band of mercenaries. This fearless group includes the spear-wielding prophet Amphiaros, Ian McShane, knife-throwing thief Autolycus, Rufus Sewell, feral warrior Tidius, Axel Henny, Amazon archer Atlanta, Ingrid Bolso Bertel, and his nephew, the storyteller Iolaus, Reese Ritchie. But Hercules carries a heavy burden. Betrayed by Hera, he was driven mad and accidentally killed his wife Megara, Irina Sheik, and their children. Haunted by these memories and visions of the three-headed Cerberus, Hercules struggles with his inner demons. One day, Hercules and his men are approached by Eugenia, Rebecca Ferguson, sent by her father, Lord Cody's, John Hurt. She seeks Hercules' help to train the Thracian army against the ruthless warlord Rhesius, Tobias Santelman. Enticed by the promise of gold, Hercules accepts the mission. After rigorous training, Hercules leads the Thracian army into battle against local barbarians, proving their newfound strength. But when Rhesius is captured, Hercules discovers a shocking truth. Rhesius was not the villain he seemed to be. Rhesius reveals that he was merely defending his people from Lord Cody's, who had poisoned Erginia's husband and seized power. The civil war was Cody's doing, and now he plans to eliminate all threats, including Erginia's son, Arius. Determined to stop Cody's, Hercules, and his loyal friends stay behind. But they are soon captured and learn of a deeper conspiracy. King Eurystheus, Joseph Fiennes, had drugged Hercules, leading to his family's death. Driven by this revelation, Hercules breaks free, unleashing his true power. With newfound strength, Hercules saves Eugenia, frees the prisoners, and leads a battle against Cody's army. Despite heavy losses, including the brave Tydeus, Hercules' team prevails. In a climactic showdown, Hercules topples a massive statue, crushing Cody's and his soldiers. With Cody's defeated, Arius ascends the throne, bringing peace to Thrace. Hercules and his companions depart, ready for new adventures. As the credits roll, we see an animated retelling of Hercules' legendary Twelve Labors, showing how he triumphed with the help of his faithful friends. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell for more epic recaps.